perfect way to end the season is with a trophy or multiple trophies and we haven't done that but given the hand we were played the start of the game today I think coming away with you know, a, a high number of goals and a clean sheet yeah I'm, I'm happy with that I think where we were at the start of the season versus where we are now is night and day different I'm fully prepared for what the next challenge will be. All right, people. Steve's talking about challenges. Last season was a challenge and this season's no different. We've been promoted to the Cheshire League and there's a lot of work to be done to get the boys ready. First up, pioneers of the YouTube football game, hashtag United. We've got a long drive down to Essex to go take on their reserves. <laughs> Individual strengths and weaknesses. Where do you rank yourself in the top tier of the club? Yeah. Oh, so if we said, okay, I want five strengths, five weaknesses, and where do you rank yourself in the team? And we've got a load of them. To yeah, I've honest. got a load of them, and I've got thirty pens. Happy days. Yeah, that's good. I was speaking to the rep afterwards, and he said, "What was he trying to show you on his phone?" He goes, "Oh, so fun still." Put your name on the paper. I want to know five things you consider a strength in your football game. Five things you consider a weakness in your football game. Let's be honest about it. You hate it because it's making you evaluate yourself and think about your game. Five. Fuck off, Mikey. Well, Not only have you spelt intelligence wrong, you put it on the good. I am going to read them and see what you all think of yourselves. Some of you are mental. But what I want you to do with doing this little exercise is to think, what are my strengths? How can I maximise my strengths in a game? How do I play to what you've written down on here? And then how do you cover up, fix, work on, and improve the things that you put on your weakness side of stuff? Speed up now. New signings have joined the club, putting various players under pressure to keep their spot in the first team. And one of those is striker Tom Jones. Yes, you heard it right, Tom Jones. <laughs> That's a header. <laughs> um, centre halves, you're going to defend this. We'll go with white first after one rep. Pink step in. Full backs, you're going to be in either the left or right side, whichever one you play in. One rep, and then step step back out again. Any questions on what you're doing? Tom, this is for defenders. You went from. Yeah. Yeah. Right, we'll go sit out. Any questions on what you're doing? Turn again. Yeah, put your tag on. Right, it's forward, Adam. Reset! Reset, Buster! What's up, Buster? Yo, 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 you might put it higher. Go on, off, tight. Just tight. Oh, it's your right shoulder. Yeah, don't, don't fucking partake. Nice, right. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Keep it. Oh, 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 Tight hamstring has taken Tom out of tonight's training, putting his place in doubt for the game with hashtag this weekend. With new signing David out of the country, Steve's got a big call to make on whether to go with unfit Tom or try find a replacement. David's David's gonna be a struggle, but if he was he can't start. Who are you forward, Tom? Hamza. I heard, I heard you weren't going to come today. 
what's changed your mind? <laughs> I know, don't know what he's talking about, you know. I was, no, all, I was no, coming no, along. No. There, was was coming big, along. There, was a, there was a big drama last, yesterday at training. You walked off the pitch. You decided not to train. And now you're on coach. Fuck yeah. Hey, boss, you're making me look bad. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> my number 10 right here changed my mind, you know. Um, told me I was being a bit stupid, you know. Service station stop off for the lads on the way down to Essex. Snickers and Twixes and all that. And Cam decides to impress. Sports scientist is Kino with his clean eating habits. After the you had for dinner yesterday, yeah, two burgers, <laughs> yeah, lettuce was in that, frozen chips, but they weren't frozen, I cooked them up. Beans, but then for dessert I had vanilla fat-free yoghurt with strawberries. Like a whole punnet of strawberries or whatever it's called. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> no, I, I encourage desserts the night before a <laughs> game get more carbs. Obviously, I'm ready to pass down. Start... No, what I'm asking, I'm asking no so. No so, what colour do you want? Bro, I'm, 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 I'm honest, I swear, I swear I'll pick it. Mum's life, you tell me what colour. I'm not doing the mind. Nah, nah, just I just swear down, tell me what colour. Just play, bro. No. What colour do you want, bro? Green. He's got a blue down. Why is he doing that? What are you doing, man? Oh, you see, you're in How? Oh, I was on Uno, four times. Nah, you didn't go with that. I was like, you know, I had a blue for me. I had a blue for me. So we're joined by Nosa from Stratford Paddock. How are you, man? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, not too bad, buddy. How was the journey down? Uh, it was good to be fair. It was good to be fair. Um, got a couple of games going, Vudo. You know. um, Is that what I could hear at the back? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Vudo, no, yeah. That's what I was going. Just, could you just hear me winning there all the time? Is that what it was? <laughs> was, what was shouting, yeah, yeah, yeah. good man. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, no, it, was, it was a good journey. I mean. And how's pre-season been, mate? Yeah, pre-season's been good so far. Um, we've been playing games on on Sundays, so um, you know it's not the hardest opposition at the moment, but. Um, Got good wins at the moment, and you know, we're just ready for a good challenge today. What, what you got into it? That's sounding so bad as well, isn't it? <laughs> God, I'm not sure what the time it is. I'm going to turn around. Oh, Nah, don't get, get that friendly mindset, yeah, you read that. Yeah, it's yeah. Friendly. No games are friendly. I don't see it. Fucking our biggest game, man. It's the biggest game in the club. Of course it is. Forget all the teams playing against us. Let's just fucking play against us. Let's check shoulders. You just change your direction. Mikey, stay that again, stay in the middle. Right, so what do you think the score's going to be today? It's probably be a close game, uh, there's a couple of tiers, I think, or well, a couple of levels of difference, but if I had to pick a team to win, then I would go for hashtag United Reserves to win, possibly 2-1, but obviously being a United fan, I want Stratford Paddock to win. 2-1 Paddock. 2-1 Paddock, yeah? Yeah, what, what's good? Do you think? Yeah, I'm it? hoping for a paddock win. Um, I'm hoping for a few goals. It's a beautiful day. Yeah, it so, is a beautiful uh, day. yeah, I think it might be um, 3 2 paddock. Right, class, thank you. Cool. Fans in confident mood then as the teams are out on the field. This is a big ass, this one. <laughs> I'm not lying to you, do you know what I mean? It might be hashtags reserves, but hashtag are quite a few levels higher than paddock, and their reserves are even playing a couple of levels higher too. Paddock are the underdogs in this one, make no mistake about it, but here's the 11 anyway. Tom Jones does make the 11. He's leading the line. Tom, from the back though, it's Vic in goal after a three month layoff with a broken ankle. Familiar names of Mickey, Will, Captain Oatsy, joined by new signing Paolo in the back four. Midfield, we've got Coyote, Nosa, and Cam with Joa, and no Ronaldo on the wings with Tom up top. On the bench, last season's player of the year, Kieran Molly. Yet to play a pre game in pre season. Connor Knowles, Aftab, and Nico, and some new faces to keep an eye on. 
I'm a run the way. Tom dropping off deep there, but it's flat footed. You're going to need to do more than that to stay in the 11, son. Lovely from the keeper there. Nice and easy. Bouncing the ball like he's professional. Hashtag on, on the counter attack. But no, Paddock pick up the pieces. Driving into midfield. There's loads of space. There's acres of space. Brown's on the ball. He gets it now. Red feet. Oh, dancing feet goes past the one defender. Comes up to the second defender. Goes past him again. Left foot into the penalty. Yeah, what's he going to do? Plays it across. Tom Jones is there and puts it in the back of the net. Tom Jones, you can't ask for better than that. Shetford Paddock won. Hashtag United nil. Tom Jones got classic hits. And listen, Tom Jones just hit a classic into the back of the net. Let's have a look at this again. There's his dancing feet. Step over, goes past the defender, hasn't got a clue what's going on. He drives into the penalty area, goalkeeper tries to close the angle, but Tom Jones is there to put the back of the net and everyone on the bench loves that. Lovely stuff, wonderful goal. Now Paddock trying to build from the back. Defender on the ball, plays it forward, nice and easy. What's going to do? Oh, lovely little flick and turn there. Blagged me. I thought the ball was going on to the other side of the pitch. It didn't. It stayed on the left side. And there's the one, two down the line. What's he going to do? He's got loads of time. He plays it into the penalty area. He gets the ball. It comes back to number 11. Foot on the ball again. Defender sizes him up. What's going on? You, the second defender falls over. You can't be falling over in the penalty area, son. He got tackled and listen, he should have hit it, but he didn't hit it. But guess what? The defender hit the floor. Let's take another look at this. The replay. He cuts inside. Is he going to shoot? No, he's not. The defender goes down like he's been shot. Nothing's going on. You should get one off, but then guess what? Another defender comes across and sorts out the business and gets a tackle in. But listen, nice footwork. Throw into Paddock. Lovely chest. Where's he going with it? He's turning on it. Turn like Scott Parker. But he, go, he, he runs down the line. He cuts in the middle lane between the two players. He's into the penalty area. He gets his shot. Keeper makes a nice, easy shave. The ball comes down the line. Stretford Paddock pick up the pieces. No, it's not. Hashtag, of, I've got the ball. He's running into space. He wants options. Paddock trying to sort themselves out of the back. But Hashtag are coming forward. He plays the ball through the middle. The keeper comes out. Is he going to get there? He doesn't get there. And the referee blows for a penalty. No one can believe it. Everyone's complaining. What's going on? They're saying. They're asking the ref. Has he had his breakfast this morning? It looks like he hasn't. He's blown his whistle. And he's given the penalty. Paddock going to have to get on with it. Hashtag penalty. Steps up. Back of the net, and it's 1-1, one, one. hashtag United 1, Stretford Paddock 1, and it's game on. Let's take a look at the penalty again, left foot, nice and easy. Actually, that's a good penalty, the keeper diving into fresh air. Get up, fluorescent colours on him. But listen, hashtag are on the ball, switching play, that's a lovely ball out to the right-hand side as he got the control number two. He manages to get it under control finally, what's he going to do, place it down the line. Complaining that the ball's gone out. The linesman says no. Continues watching the game. Hashtag switching the play to the left-hand side. Size up the defender. Cuts into the D. Plays it back for his... And, oh, great save. Absolutely great, great save. One for the cameras there from the goalkeeper. He didn't save the penalty, but he saved that shot. Fantastic stuff. Hashtag with the goal kick. Big kick. Who's going to win the Redders? Paddock won it, but he falls to a hashtag player. Nice little flick off, number six. Gets his technique right, puts it into the mixer. And there again, the goalkeeper comes out. Car man's wonderful stuff. Looking for someone to roll the ball out to, but he doesn't. He kicks it left-footed, Edison style, down the pitch. Half time it is, and that's a nice half that. Wonderful stuff, hashtag one. Stretford Paddock won. I think the line at times was a bit too deep and it invited him on. Odd time it's been a bit deep. Other than that, I think it's been fine. Paolo, you've been really composed in there, just sometimes a little bit early release. If we win the ball early there, win the ball and then challenges, then we can go, we can go wide early. At the minute, we've we've been the team that has been dominating the game, choosing how we want to play it. It's hot as fuck. When you get the chance, slow the game down, but then move it quickly into these pockets. Second half about to get underway. Stretford Paddock shooting the other way. Lay the ball back. It's game on, remember. It's one all. Play the ball out to the right hand side. Number two's on the ball. What's he going to do? Plays it infield. Ball goes out wide. Can he take on his defender? He can, but he doesn't. He comes inside. He dinks one into the penalty area. Floats it in. What's he going to do? Gets it under control. Lays it back. Now they're in. Paddock are in. And it, oh, and it comes off the crossbar. It comes off the crossbar. I think wonderful shot and effort. That's all you can ask. Get into the mixer and lash it in. It came off the bar. The keeper had no chance. And listen, very unlucky. Very, very unlucky. Good effort. Corner kick. Short one. Worked, it on, a, worked on it on the training ground. The ball comes in. Who's going to get the red to it? Hashtag get the red to it. Overhead kick. Oh, just past the post. 
just past the post unlucky son hashtag on the ball they're searching for a goal as well they're, they're trying to build up nice and slowly Paddock have got the shape correct hashtag knocking it around at the back well they're going to go long they're going to go short they decide to go long Big Sam now the ball's in the ba keeper comes out oh he claims it he claims it it wasn't hard he got played through and the keeper dealt with it Paddock on the ball now centre of the park he's looking for options he plays it forward good body swerve comes out can he get a shot off he can't get a shot off and that's a wonderful goal into the back of the net 2-1 to Stretford Paddock absolutely fantastic goal from distance even the referee loved that absolutely fantastic goal listen you can't ask for better than that watch when the ball comes into him he sets himself he sets his body there's his one touch sets his body correctly important the keeper doesn't see it and it flies past him it hits the back of the net and that's absolutely great and listen let me tell you something I told you before it was a hard game but when you've got goals like that in your the game becomes much easier Hashtag on the ball, striding forward, driving into midfield. Stretford Paddock trying to get the ball off him, he wriggles through. Well, can he get a shot? The guy's space on the left wing, he gets his shot off. Oh, you can't believe it. Hashtag big head. Had got a chance to clear it, will they clear it? He gets it as far as he can. Hashtag try and win the ball, but, but Paddock, Paddock, Paddock have got it. What's his footwork like on the edge? Claiming for the throw in. Referee says yes. Throw into Paddock, throws it down the line, big throw. This is where you cry your strength. A good tackle from the hashtag defender though. He wins the ball, plays it back into the penalty area. Now they need to get rid of it. They do get rid of it, but they play it on the floor. Nice football, playing it down the line. Paddock have got to get tighter here. No, no, son, that's your fault. If you're going to play the ball into midfield and not find a player in the white shirt, that's your fault. Don't blame anybody else. But listen, Paddock, they're trying to win the ball back. And that's the end of the match. Well, 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 good start to the pre-season. A couple more big tests coming up to get the lads ready for what's to come in the Cheshire League. Make sure to follow the journey right here on YouTube. But more than that, you can own it. Do you get me? That's right. Last month, we launched a fan ownership, 100 plus none. Own this club and don't just watch the journey be on it and as for Tom he's bagged so well done Tom and we'll see you in the next one what's my score predictions for what the game 2-1 <laughs> and I think I score in the 15th minute he scored in is that a cross from an Real fan ownership, real fan input, real fan change, real fan power. 50 plus one, we can go better than that. 100 plus none. Download our app, view the free content, read about the club, that's fine. But if you want more, become a member. To vote, to go behind the scenes, to make an impact, interact with a global community around the world, influencing how we grow, where we play, club ethics and values. The more members we have, the faster we grow. Support the club, run the club, own the club. This is ours and no one will take it away. The future is in all our hands.